Welcome everyone to the sports quiz presented to you by Quest, the Cruising Society of Shri Guru Gobind Singh College of Commerce, University of Delhi. Let's begin with the quiz. Uh, we would first move on to the rules of the quiz. There are a total of twenty questions in the prelims. Each question is worth one point. Questions one, ten, thirteen, and fifteen are star mark questions, which will be considered in case there is a tie. In case of persistent ties, time will be taken into consideration. Answers have to be submitted through the Google form only. And make sure you submit the form within time. Moving on to question number one. Uh, this is a star mark question. Eds was Scottish by origin, but was raised in England. He wanted to pursue a career in football and joined the Rangers Football Club at the age of fifteen. He played with the club for three years until a knee injury ended his dream. Talking about his football career, he told Observer Sport Monthly, "I was a naturally aggressive left back, a cut throat tackler." You may have got past once, but there was never ever a second occasion. Although it claims to have played for the first team on three occasions, his claims were found to be inaccurate. He did, however, featured in a testimonial game in 1985, where he was listed in the squad. Identify Eds, who is now popular in a different field. So you need to give us Eds, and you can focus on the fact that he is now popular in a very different field. Moving on to question number two. After receiving a suspension from his domestic side, Western Australia, Eds decided to spend his spare time by watching the T20 international between Australia and New Zealand from the ground with his girlfriend. Before the match, Australia's management found themselves in a fit when Brad Hodge suffered a back injury during warm-up. Australia didn't have any replacements that suited their team combination. In an urgent call to action, Australia decided to draft Eds into the eleven for the only T20 international he ever played in his career. Identify Eds. Moving on to question number three. Eds, an F1 constructor, caused massive controversy at the beginning of the 2020 F1 season after they were accused of illegally copying parts of the 2019 Y car, which also resulted in Eds being labeled as the Pink Y. After angry protest from other teams, FIA launched an investigation. Which concluded that Eds had copied Y's rear brake duds, and hence Eds was fined 15 constructor points and 400,000 pounds. Identify Eds and Y. For the hint, uh, you can uh, focus on the fact that Eds was being labeled as the pink Y. So I think that will give you the answer. Moving on to question number four. In 2014. Martin Crow coined a term in a Cricket Info article. This term gained immense popularity and has been used a lot in the cricketing fraternity in the following years. The term seeks to create a premium category among the present cricketers and was a testament to Crow's prediction in 2014. You might have seen some reactionary fans on social media arguing to amend or remove this term. Identify the term. So this term has recently received a lot of scrutiny after one of the players was excluded even after. Some stellar performances. Moving on to question number five. Ronda Rousey, Brock Lesnar, Dan Seven, Ken Shamrock, CM Punk. Identify the common link between this and in, uh, in between this exhaustive list. Fairly an easy question for the quiz. You need to give us the common link between all these. Moving on to question number six. Few stadiums are more mythical and hostile, especially for away teams than Eds. It provides a special atmosphere every time Y plays at home. It has been the home of Y since their formation in 1892. But before their formation, it was used by their eternal enemy Z from 1884 to 1891. There were many reasons for Z to vacate and move across to a different stadium, including a long-running dispute with a board member and owner of the stadium. Due to his political views and constantly rising rents, identify X and Z. So you need to give us X and Z, and we do not need Y. And there are plenty of hints in the question itself. Moving on to question number seven. Since the 1979-80, only four Indian Test captains have worse win percentage than X, who has 16% in 25 matches. Although most of them were short-term captains, including Ray Shield. K. Shrikant, zero percent in four matches. Kundappa Vishwanath, zero percent in two matches, and K. L. Rahul, zero percent in a single match. The only notable and almost unbelievable outlier is Y, with eleven point seven six percentage in thirty-four matches. 
identify h and y so i think h is probably an easy guess and y someone who many people don't know belongs to this list moving on to question number 8 Water polo is an interesting sport that has gained popularity and is also incorporated in the Olympics. When we hear water polo, we assume that it's a derivation of an obvious sport H, but it's not so. The main difference between water polo and H is why. During the initial days of the sports world, water polo included barrels painted like Y with the players sitting atop them and hitting the balls. What is the possible difference Y here? So I think H is a probably an easy guess. We need to give us why. Moving on to question number nine. Which footballer has taken the jersey number 39 at his new club as a tribute to his dad's statsy number? He has mentioned that he has been inspired by players at Gundogan and Iniesta. This footballer has got popular fairly recently after gaining a cult in the analytical community, after which he got transferred in this January window. So you need to give us the footballer who has taken jersey number 39 as a tribute to his dad's taxi number. Someone who recently got transferred in this January window. Moving on to question number 10, a star mark question. In baseball, the pitcher and the catcher are considered a single unit and are collectively referred to as the dash of the team. This term was first coined in the 1860s by Ed Stadwick, who compared the firepower of a team's pitching staff to that of artillery dash used in the Civil War. Fill in the blanks. Moving on to question number 11. The term used in this sport when the ball leaves the field or gets stopped by one of the men is called a dead ball. Expert players have been known to shoot out the balls at over 50 km an hour. The rules generally prohibit spinning, which are over 300, minus 300 degrees shots, which involves the use of the palm to spin the ball all around instead of using his toads. However, since 2012, the annual World Championships and the World Cup have started allowing two of these per match. This sport was often seen as being played by the characters of an extremely famous TV series. Which sport is being talked about? So you need to give us the sport. And you can focus on the fact that uh, the, uh, it was being played by the characters of an extremely famous TV series. Moving on to question number 12. Ed sold this distant record of having the biggest difference between his highest and second highest test scores, 277 runs. He achieved this feat in December 2016, but was rather surprisingly dropped from the side in March 2017. If Ed ever gets recalled into the test team, his first target would be to get a score of 68 or more to restore the record to its long-time holder, Ari Foster, who made his debut in the Ashes of 1994. So this is probably an easy question. You need to give us Eds. Moving on to question number 13. Again, a star mark question. Eds was a basketball player who has made a very popular shoe brand, which follows a different strategy than most. He previously had a deal with the Reebok before he signed up with a multi-chain store to make affordable shoes for kids. He recounts that a woman once told him about the expensive shoes he sold, which made him think about this idea. I was in all stores and my price point for the shoes was $19 to $29. And since, since then, we sold over 400 million pairs. It's not kids that don't want to wear $20 shoes. They don't want to wear shoes that look like they cost $20. Identify Eds, who has made a very popular shoe brand, which is quite opposite to what normal shoe brands charge for their, consumer, charge for their shoes. Moving on to question number 14. Farooq engineer Surinder Khanna, Sayyid Kirmani, Kiran More, CS Pandit, Nayan Mondia, and MS Dhoni. What is this list of and fill in the blanks? So in, uh, this, is an, in, uh, this is an exhaustive list and you need to give us what is this uh, list of and also the missing blank. Moving on to question number 15. Again, a star mark question. In 2005, post his retirement, Eds, often referred to as one of the most notoriously short fused men on earth, arrived in Sao Paulo, Brazil, at a nightclub. A cameraman followed Eds in the nightclub and even after his request, did not respect his privacy. Eds decided to attack the cameraman and allegedly broke his recording equipment. Eds was then interrogated for hours 
and was asked to appear in the court the next day and testify before a judge. Identify Edson and how did he arrive the next day to mod the Brazilian court and the nation. So you can focus on the last part, which says uh, that he did something to mod the Brazilian court and the nation. Moving on to the next question. In 2021, Edson became a minority owner in New York City's Rochester Rhinos. After four inactive, inactive years, the club is set to be rebranded, relocated, and researched. Edson's role in the club is being made into a Rhino reboot documentary. The club is set to return in 2022. Although you would associate the club Edson plays for with another animal, identify Edson. So you need to give us Edson. Moving on to the next question, question number 17. Edz was born in Islamabad and in the 1980s before his parents decided to migrate to another country. Edz featured in the 20, 2006 Under-19 World Cup, making 140 runs in four matches. Later in 2011, he became the first Muslim to represent his, this nation at the highest level when he got injured when he got fit in the test side, replacing the captain who was injured. Identify Edz. And you can focus on the part that he was born in Islamabad, but then decided to migrate to another country. Moving on to question number 18. Edson is the current NBA player who is the son of Y. Y is a former number one overall pick in the 1978 NBA draft and went on to win two NBA championships for the Los Angeles Lakers. He is currently a Lakers radio commentator. His son Edson recently came back from two severe injuries that kept him out of the game for nearly three years. Edson is known for his straight shooting ability and currently ranks 18th in all-time leaders of three-pointers made in the NBA. Identify Edson Y. So Edson is someone who is known for his straight shooting ability for three-pointers in recent times. So you need to give us Edson Y. Moving on to question number 19. In 2020, Ed started streaming him playing video games to his now 4 million Twitch followers giving him the idea to start his own esports brand. After consulting experts, Edge founded Q Esports and serves as the CEO and the face of the company. Q has a combined 786,000 followers on Instagram, Twitter, and Twitch, with a further 84,000 subscribers on YouTube. Edge's presence has brought the esports team high-profile sponsors, including Puma, IQ Option, and Twitch. The team has won three out of 10 tournaments they have participated in, earning a total of $161,000 in prize money. Identify Edge. And this is uh, probably a very easy question. Moving on to question number 20. This modern sport, a craze amongst the teens, was initially not a sport, but a religious ceremony. In the 3rd or the 4th century AD in Germany, this ceremony was held in the churches. A certain arrangement of states was made, and then these states were hit by stones. The more streets you hit, the purer, cleansed from sin you were. These streets and stones evolved into their present form and formed a sport which you will find in the lanes of a mall. Which sport are we talking about? So you need to give us the sport and you can focus more on the later part of the question and probably there are a lot of hints in the question. Moving on to 